An initiating committee is gathering petition signatures with the hope that the Amarillo City Council will pass an ordinance making it a sanctuary city for the unborn, effectively outlawing abortion and adding other restrictions. Tonight, KM Local 4's Kaylee Green has the latest on their efforts. That story from your local election headquarters. The Amarillo City Council has already met and discussed a potential anti-abortion ordinance. Last month, they were given three proposed versions of an ordinance, but they haven't taken any action. This group is aiming for at least 6,000 signatures on the petition for their version of the ordinance. As long as we have enough, then that ordinance will go before the mayor and city council, and they'll have the ability to accept or reject that ordinance. And if that ordinance is rejected, then at that point it will go have the opportunity to go on the ballot for the next available election. Mark Lee Dixon, the founder of the Sanctuary Cities for the Unborn initiative, is not from Amarillo but working to get the petition to the council. He says 55 other Texas cities and counties have passed similar ordinances and he believes it should be passed by the votes of the mayor and the council. It does not look like we have a majority on the council that is willing to pass an ordinance which would prohibit abortion trafficking. Uh, an ordinance that uses the same kind of enforcement mechanism as the Texas Heartbeat Act. John Barrett is collecting signatures for the petition. While there's language in the ordinance that would place restrictions on traveling for an abortion, he says they are not targeting the mothers of unborn children. What we're saying is that the facilitating of an abortion by people to transport a mother to other states is basically, as I understand it, what this goes what this addresses. Right now, Dixon says Texas's abortion ban is not enough. This is about the abolition of abortion entirely. And by prohibiting abortion trafficking on residents of Amarillo, uh, we are saying truly that we are prepping for an abortion-free America. Amarillo City Council Member for Place 3, Tom Sherlin, says right now the group will have to get 5,700 signatures on that petition. Sherlin says he cannot speak for the entire council, but they're waiting to see the outcome. He says in part tonight, quote, if it qualifies, the council will decide whether to vote on it or take it to the election of our citizens. He then goes on to say, in my opinion, since the group is using a petition format, it would be proper to take it to the voters for their decision. Live in studio, Kaylee Green, KMR Local 4 News. Maya. Kaylee, thank you. We have reached out to other Amarillo City Council members for comment. Jeff, Josh Kraft and Les Simpson declined. We haven't heard back yet from Don Tips and Mayor Cole Stanley wasn't available for comment today.